As of November 14th, Jalen Brunson is averaging 24 points a game. He's shooting 46% from the field at about 19 attempts per game. It's a small sample size at 11 games played, but he's right around where he needs to be due to the inclusion of Carl Anthony Towns on the Knicks because he's taking away shots. If you break down his field goal attempts at 19 a game, he's shooting six threes a game at about 38% while putting up 13 twos a game at about 50%. He's down in both categories, but still far more efficient than several of his peers at the position. Jalen's issue early on this season is where on the floor he's missing shots that he normally makes. The answer to that question is clear, the deeper that we dive into his statistics. From zero to three feet from the basket, he's shooting 68%, which is up from last year. From three to 10 feet out, He's shooting 48%, which is right around where he usually ends the season at. But in the mid-range, that's where his problem lies. He's shooting 33% at the moment from 10 to 16 feet out. Just last year, he shot 47%. That's a 14% difference from that distance. That's his problem. With Jalen Brunson, it's not about taking shots away from him. It's not about replacing some of his three-point attempts with twos. He's fine. He's at about a two to one ratio in terms of twos and threes, with him taking 13 twos a game and six threes a game. With Jalen, it's about hitting the mid range that he always hit in his career. When he does that, he'll be back up to about 26 to 27 a game. 